I think there's challenges all the time. Mm-hmm. Um, I think everybody's dealing with so much. Everybody's life is so unique and so, uh, and so different. One of the most amazing ways that you can reprogram your mind is the idea of adversity. If everybody's dealing with adversity, then it should be more of a normal thing that we talk about, that we prepare for, that we think about. And so when adversity comes and you have those adverse times, it's not a weakness in your life. It's not something that you necessarily have to overcome. It could end up being your strength. And that's one of the biggest changes that you can make in your mind because adversity, people are looking. I like to think now that I have kids that uh, my kids are like sponges and they're watching me. So what are they learning? If they're learning just daily things when life is going well, um, that's not really stuff that sticks with them that they remember. If I'm going through some adversity and there's some tough thing that I have to overcome, there's always somebody watching. And especially you uh, too, you're watching yourself and you understand who you're seeing in the mirror. So when that adversity comes, that's your moment for strength. That's your moment to define who you are. That's your moment to inspire other people. That's your moment to create confidence and create who you want to be in the future. That's your moment to step up. So these adverse times, once you reprogram it, that's the exciting time because you're going to learn from it. Somebody else is watching. They're going to learn from it and you have a chance to inspire. And a lot of people are looking for purpose. And what they don't realize is adverse times is a chance to inspire and to give purpose to your life and to give purpose to other people's lives.